everyone welcome to the session on solid works in this session we are going to design a hexagonal nut we will start by clicking on new we'll select part okay now this is the chart for the hexagonal nuts we can see here the nominal sizes now suppose if i want to use the nominal size of m10 the maximum value of this diameter will be 16 and the thickness as you can see your h in the side view for m10 is 8.4 so we will first go to front plane normal 2 then i'll go to sketch and I'll select polygon. Next, I'll go to smart dimension and I'll give this distance as 16. This edge I am going to make vertical. So, this is fully defined. Also, I'll draw a circle at the center. and give it dimension 8.5 which is the inner dimension next i'll go to features and extrude feature i'll select sketch 1 and i'll give the depth as 8.4 this i'll choose as mid plane and this is done Now, if you see here, we need to give the chamfer. So, I will give chamfer by selecting this face. I'll go to sketch and I'll draw a circle. You can draw the circle randomly. Then you can select one edge and the circle and give the relation as tangent. Okay, so you can see here the circle has been created. Next, I'll go to extrude cut and I'll select the circle. I'll choose flip side to cut. I'll give an angle of 60 degree and click on okay so this is done now whatever you have done on this side you can create the same on the other side by clicking on mirror we need to select the plane or the face this is the front plane that we need to select and you can see here the cut extrude is going to get mirrored i click on okay so this is done on both the sides. Now I want to add chamfer at the center. So I'll go to fillet and click on chamfer. I'll select this edge and this edge. Both edges are selected. I'll give this dimension as 0 0.75. This angle is 45 degree. And I'll click on OK. So the chamfer is done. Next, I want to create thread inside. So, I will go to insert annotations cosmetic thread. I'll select this edge and give this value as 10. This value is up to next and click on OK. Now you cannot see anything. The reason is you need to come to this options. Go to document properties. Detailing. Here the shaded cosmetic thread is not highlighted. So select that and click on OK. So now you can see the threading. So that's how you design a hexagonal nut in SOLIDWORKS. We will see another option of 
giving this chamfer in this hexagonal nut in the next session. So with this, I end the session. I hope you have understood how to make a hexagonal nut in SolidWorks. If you have any doubts, please write to me in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell icon for latest video updates. See you in the next session. Thank you.